Jay Cooley with the Stooley. We got Batwoman versus War Woman from Invincible. We decided to win by strength, speed, durability, powers, and IQ. Let's go. Starting off with Batwoman, she's actually surprisingly really strong, being able to beat people like Killer Croc and even Mr. Freeze, and also being able to beat Bane, of all people, who we already know is strong, and she's even beaten Batman before on one occasion. And speed-wise, nothing really too much there. And durability-wise, she was able to take attacks from Bane, but now to her powers, which is nothing, just like mainly most of the Bat family or all of them, but she has weapons and IQ. She has a high intellect, but now from War Woman, from Invincible who strength-wise was able to make Omni-Man bleed, which is no easy feat in dirt, I mean, not durability. Speed-wise, she was able to keep up with Omni-Man until she was surprised by him and got her neck snapped. Durability-wise, no feats there. Powers, strength, speed, durability. She has her mace, so weapons and IQ. She obviously doesn't win that, but who would really win? I'm going to go with War Woman winning this because, I mean... Strength-wise, making Omni-Man bleed, I think, is just a better strength feat than just beating up Bane or Killer Croc or Batman. And speed-wise, being able to keep up with that man when you have no speed feats, yeah. And really, it would be high diff because Batwoman, she's more durable, I would say, because she took a beating from Bane. And she would be able to take, you know, she could take a punch. And she has a high intellect, so she would be able to kind of slither out of some of the attacks but not too many of them because the speed, power, and strength of War Woman is just way more than Batwoman could imagine. So, yeah, War Woman wins with high difficulty. Guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below. Y'all think win this fight, and I'm out of here. Deuces.